Hey guys, it is Claudia and today I'm going to be doing a what's on my iPhone 6s and I recently just got a, a new phone just because I had the crappy 4s before. I mean guys, you guys might like it but mine had cracks all over it and it was just like done. And as you can see, I'm to a little bit of a new background. I'm just by my bed and the thing right here. As you can see, I took off all my Halloween pillows. And I still have my fall wreath up. This is still fall. I'm probably going to transition into more winter and Christmassy kind of stuff the day after Thanksgiving or the day before my family does it. One of those days. And then I'll start in like mid-November and doing all that kind of stuff because it is like my favorite time of the year. Like, it is. So um, I usually go all out for that and you'll have a really pretty Christmassy kind of background. But right now we're just in like the normal fall -y kind of stage, but Halloween is over. So all my Halloween decorations are down. But yeah, uh, this was a requested video because um, you guys, well, one of my subscribers heard in my October favorites that I got a new phone and they would like, they wanted a 6S video, so I thought I would do it with you guys today. And I have the rose gold one, and this is, this is like the box, so I know this is kind of weird, why am I showing you that? But I have a screen protector on, that isn't a crack right there, it is just from the screen protector, I have a little bubble there. But that's just what the front looks like. It, I think it's the same size as the 6, but it may be a little bit bigger. I don't really know. And then I do have an OtterBox case on it, which I am actually going to take off so you guys can see the phone. Okay, so this is like the final phone. This is what it looks like. This is the front. I just got the white, and I have the little touch screen. And then on the back is the rose gold. I don't know how good you're going to see it on camera, but it is a rose gold. Like, some lightings, you can see it really nice and, like, pink, but then some lightings, it just, just, like, looks like gold. But it is rose gold. I think the picture quality is amazing. I love it. I, would like, really, this has, like, been a huge upgrade from the 4S, so it's, like, so much better, guys. And I, I believe I have the 16 gigabyte, but maybe more. See, this is just what the phone looks like. I have a glass protector screen on it. So what I do, I have my little fingerprint. I don't really have a picture there, just like the picture that they gave me. Got to get out of my messages. Okay, so I'm going to tell you guys what's on my phone and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, as you can see here, this is more of like my homepage. Since I just got this phone last week, I haven't been really able to like personalize it and like change things around. Okay, doing it like this is a lot easier for me. So like I said, this is the home page. I haven't been really able to personalize it. And as you can see, if you go like this, you could see like a search bar and you have some people here and some apps right here that are most used, which I think that's really cool. And you get some like news that's going on today, which I believe only the 6S has and there's like a nearby, which is really cool. Like it tells you your nearby restaurants, bars, shopping places, and gas. So that's kind of cool. So this is the home page. Haven't been able to really personalize it. And what you get to do, it's really cool, is if you press on the screen really hard, it goes up new message and then people that you texted recently. Um, so yeah, and then you can press on that and it opens up in a new message. That's really cool. And you could do that with most apps like email. You can do that too, which only the 6S can do this, which is really cool. And for phone, you could do it. Most people you've called, create new contact. Really cool. And then when you go into your next page, you have all of these apps, which, well, these are all the apps that I use mostly. I do not use the Google Watch. They just gave that to me. I'm not really sure if I could delete it. No, I can't delete it. It is more personal, but I will probably be giving it away maybe soon, but not right now. So then I have Instagram, which I absolutely love Instagram. This is my feed. Go follow me at ClaudiaCasey972. This is my most recent picture of me and my friends on Halloween. We were all apps. And then this is a selfie I took and just some other pictures that I have. And then, yeah. Um, so then I have pages, which this is like a docs kind of thing. You can like write um, uh, like paragraphs and that kind of stuff on it, which is kind of cool. I have in Campus Portal, which shows me, shows me all my grades from school, which is really cool that um, our school has an app. So like every time our teachers put in like an assignment, I could see it there. I have Influencer, which I love this app. This app, um... Uh, like it, I do surveys and then they could send me things for doing the surveys and I review them on social media. So that's a kind of cool app. I think I'm just Claudia Casey972 on that app too. Then I have Musically, which I love Musically. Um, I think it's really cool. If you want to know my account, I am Claudia Casey and I do some really cool Musically. Some of them have some bad language in them, but I just do them because I think they're kind of fun. 
then I have Famebit, which is also a company where, like, you give a proposal to a company's, like, product, and then they may send it to you. But it's mostly for people who have lots of subscribers. Like, I've tried a bunch, and I really have not gotten them. But I don't know if that's just me. But then I have AudioTube, which I listen to some music on, which I've been jamming to Sorry by Justin Bieber recently. I have Nordstrom Rack, which I usually just use this app for Hot Look because Sephora, which you guys know, looking at Sephora is awesome. I mean, I don't really, I'm not able to get everything on there, but I do go on it a lot just to browse at the new products. I have Read Tell Me Not, which is a coupon app, which I get some coupons off of. And then I have Amazon, which I make some wish lists off wish lists off Amazon. Ask FM, which I have not been on in a while, but basically it's an anonymous person asks you a question and you answer it. I believe my Ask FM is, I will actually go to it. Hold on. My Ask FM is Claudia Casey 4. So if you want to go check that out and ask me a question, definitely do that. Then I have ABC Family Watch. I have not used this app yet. I just went into my purchase apps on my new phone and this is one of them, so I just downloaded that one to see, but I haven't used it. Then Vine. I have not been on Vine in a while, but I believe I'm just Claudia Casey um, on it, but I don't really post Vines. I just retweet things, re-Vine things, but I haven't in a while, so you don't really have to follow me on that. Then I have the Starbucks app, which I love Starbucks app. I use this all the time when I'm going. I'm on the gold level. Four more stars until my next reward. So that's kind of cool. And then I have Pinterest, which I love Pinterest. I will show you my account, and then you can go follow me. Oh, I have not logged in on my new phone yet, which I need to do that. So hold on a second. Okay, so I'm, I'm on it now. The last time I was on it was on my old phone and on my iPad. So, yeah, I logged into my new phone. This is it right here. I'm Claudia KC972. I don't know why my picture is not loading, but I have one there. And, that, yeah, there it is. And then, yeah, this is just my feed. I like to, I have a makeup storage pin. I have some fall treats and then sweets. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. I love Pinterest, so if you want to comment your Pinterest down below, I will definitely follow you. And then there is Twitter. I really like Twitter, too. I think it's kind of cool. Um, and my username is ClaudiaCasey972. And then I have Pandora, which I use if I'm just, like, going on a run or if I'm on the bus and I want to listen to some music, but I don't really have any I like. And then I have Facebook, which I have not been on in a while also. I Enigma, and what it is, basically my math teacher does some apps that are on her phone. And we use that app for, like, this math thing we do. And then we have Airbrush, which I just got this app. I have not really tried it out yet, but I guess it's supposed to, like, make your face, like, more perfective. I don't really know. I haven't tried it. And then I have the YouTube app, which is one of my favorite apps. I go on this if I'm watching YouTube videos on my phone, which usually I'm watching them on my computer or iPad, but sometimes on my phone. And then I have Voidogram, which, um, basically, if your picture's too big, I put a, like, a border around it, which is white, and, yeah, or you can change colors. And then there's me and Caitlin at my friend's um, party that was outside. So yeah, that's basically all my apps. And if you guys want to know my email, it is ClaudiaCasey972 at gmail.com. So yeah, that's basically my phone. I hope you guys liked this video. Um, it was nothing too exciting, but I thought this video was kind of cool to film. So that was everything that was on my iPhone 6S. Um, I don't really know. I this video was requested. I like doing these kind of videos. They're kind of fun to watch to see what apps other people use and to see like how their phone is if you don't have that one. So I hope you guys all enjoyed this video and please like this video, comment down below some other videos you guys would like me to do and subscribe to my channel to get notifications and it's free and you get to be a part of my little family which I don't have a name yet for us. But I'll get there with it. So yeah, this is just the case that they gave me. I don't really know why I'm showing this. But yeah, Bye, guys, and I love you guys so much. Mm.